So I want to talk about something that's been really, really annoying me lately. This is going to be ics about men, but single mom version. So something that's been getting under my skin is men not understanding what it means to be a single mom. So as a single mom, a single working mom, I have my plate full to the maximum, right? I don't have free time. The time that I do have free, I just want to relax. So one, I get it. I'm single. Yes. Do I want to date? Sure. If I meet the right person, right? But if you invite me out for a dinner um, or drinks, especially during the weeknight, come on. You know I have things to do. I'm sure you have things to do the next day. I have a child to take care of. I can't just go out late at night just whenever, right? Um, so you have to take that into consideration. So if you're really going to invite me out, one, make it worth my time. And what do oh, I mean by making it worth my time? No. Just, just don't invite me out to dinner and drinks. Get creative. Invite me out for an activity. Do something different. Do something that's going to be worth my time and effort. I am taking time out of my evening to meet with you, to go and enjoy your company, you know, to see how things work. If we're compatible, I'm making an effort. So I expect you to make an effort. So don't just assume that I'm going to be able to drop off my child somewhere because most likely I'm not. So unless you're offering to pay for the babysitter, I'm not going on that date. Also, in offer to pay for the babysitter that's going to make me more receptive to want to go oh to hell no and another thing do not just assume that you can invite me and my daughter out no i do not introduce my daughter to guys that's a no-no so there's that and also don't just assume that you're going to invite me out for drinks and i'm going to show up um what makes you think that i'm going to put my safety in jeopardy by drinking and driving so unless you're gonna offer to pick me up and drop me off or uber me there and back it's a no on the drinks during the week so moral of the story is come on guys if she's a single mom she already has a lot on her plate so don't add to her plate don't make her life more stressful don't make her plan out the day that you want to take her on like that's not gonna happen so all I'm gonna say is do better and to everyone asking me out on freaking dates lately literally if the shoe fits then it fits okay that's all i gotta say wow where do i start uh with that one you know it amazes me how women really think that they're entitled to a man's resources even a man that they're not even romantically involved with it's okay for a man to spend money, to do all of these things. You know, a drink and a dinner is not even good enough for her. She actually thinks that she's entitled to a man's resources. And then she says, you should offer to pay for the babysitter, really? But then she says, don't expect to meet my daughter. I mean, the, the gall of women these days like that is just, it's crazy to me. First of all, you're a single mom. That's already a strike against you for somebody that wants to build. I know you don't like it, ladies, but it's true. Men think about that. You're a single mom. You seem very masculine. You seem kind of bitchy. Men are not definitely not attracted to that. And I know that what you're going on is, oh, look, I'm attractive. So men should just, you know, bow down to whatever I need and whatever I say. That's why you're single. That's why men don't want to deal with it. And obviously you're having a lot of problems because you had to come on TikTok and make a video about that. Stop thinking that you're entitled to a man's money. It doesn't matter to you that men waste money on dates. That's why men don't want to go on dates. That's why men are like, hey, you know, just come through, slide through the house. Let's watch a movie. Let's do something like that because he's trying to get some kind of uh, return on his investment. Too many men go out and date these women spend money and get nothing in return but for women it's totally fine it's totally fine they don't call that usury but that's exactly what it is you are not entitled to a man's resources you have the power to achieve anything you want don't let anything or anyone distract you from your goals and remember stay focused stay strong and stay positive Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with those in need.